This is Life by Lady E, and this is what we're going to do in our interactive notebook this week. Hey guys, so we were not able to finish all of our planned activities from last week, so we're going to continue them this week. And like I said, for this one, we are going to go through all the pictures using his train and I don't have the train right now but I'm gonna use this one and then we will just name each picture and maybe I'll ask him to spell them if if they're just CBC words and then the next one is for Filipino it's just sorting boy and girl I have a few photos that he will do here and then for this one, he will just choose the correct starting letter. Then that one also. Then for this one, CA again, he will just put the missing letters. He will just write the missing letters. This one also. And then for Filipino, he will then again sort different members of the family. And then for science, he will just connect these for CA we will just read these sight words and then the next is science we will just connect these words to the correct action to the correct pictures to the correct action and then we will also do them Anyways, for Filipino, I have a few things which you will sort into Bahay and Silid Aralan. Bahay is house, Silid Aralan is the classroom. So he will put the furniture or things which we can which can be found in the house and in the classroom. And then for CA, I have a, I have some pictures. He will read the sight words and then he will glue the correct picture. And then for this one, we will either dab or color the foods that make us strong and healthy, whichever he wants. And then for Filipino, again, more items at the home, in the farm. I think these are animals, animals, forest and sea. For CA, it's just connecting, reading and connecting. And then for science, more connecting. We will just connect the these action words to these animals, to the movement of the animals. And then this is just connecting the same figures. And then I have more pictures and then, no, I think they're words. And then he will sort them into long A, long E, I, O, and U. And then this is for science, just sequencing. For Filipino, he will choose the correct, correct figure. That's the same as this, these ones in this column. Then next. More connecting short A until U, and then for this one, I think I have the words which he can glue here, and then for Filipino, it's just more connecting partners. For example, the toothbrush goes with the teeth, and so on. I think that's the last one yeah that's the last one so that's it for this week's interactive notebook if you want more ideas you can visit my blog at ladyrecipebox.blogspot.com and you can also subscribe to this channel so that you won't miss 
any of our activities in our interactive notebook. Thanks, guys. Bye.